Hello and welcome to my channel, I play the Win Gaming. Today we are going through the Flow 12 of Abyss 4.3 and wait, what? Why am I in Honkai Star L? Oh my god, okay, fine, fine, fine. Let me go to Genshin Impact and let me restart from the beginning. Hello and welcome to my channel, I play the Win Gaming. Today we are going through the Flow 12 of Spiral Abyss that is present in 4.3 that has been released quite a bit two days before I guess so yeah let's jump right into it and also get all the tips and tricks that we can do to solve it or do to defeat the whole chambers and then get the three sorry get the three stars from each chamber or maybe get the 36 stars from all 10 11 12 and sorry 9 10 11 and 12 so let's begin Okay, so we have uh, this, so I'll be obviously choosing this, but yesterday's uh, trial I tried, I had some other uh, options, okay my dear, so anyways, shall we begin, so let's begin with her ultimate, his ultimate, her ultimate, and then her ultimate, finally. Dealing some 56k damage. Wait. How is my Ningguang dealing so much of damage than Nafia? No idea. There might be some, uh, what to say, uh, rotation miss because I'm not so sure with the Geo how do they even work with that pyro so I'm kind of doing the unga bunga stuffs over here be careful of other characters as well I mean other enemies that are okay 45k I don't think I have raised her that good Oh, 190k. Even I am surprised. Oh my god, 45k. That's so good. So now we are in the first half. Sorry, first chamber, second half. Do whatever you want. But only thing is don't let it hit you. Uh, why did I do that? Try to do the eye framing stuffs. Do this. Wait for it. Don't let it hit you. But you can hit. No, what? You know what? I'll hit no matter what. Uh, excuse me. Uh, okay. To make myself look happier, I need to. I had to use the ultimate of Yoimiya. I mean, to make him suffer, I need to use, right? I need to use something. So, yeah, this is how I I did it. With kind of no rotation or maybe... It is kind of a planned rotation, if you could say. But I couldn't save Yoimiya's uh, ultimate at the end. So, bad luck for me. So, let's take uh, character energy recharge because I don't have a healing part over here because it is showing like this so which is no use for me personally I should have gone over here and then got it. hey 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 
Calm down, mate. Wait. Yeah, we can we can easily defeat them, but as it is, as they're not too tough to crack. Oh my God, 2.1, 2, 2, 2, 200,000? Lovely, right? This is kind of an off, off rotation. You can try with the uh, on rotation, but yeah. But still, even the off rotation works for uh, Ningwang and uh, Navia because they they're just they just need uh, what they wanted. That's it. Done. Done with the first half of chamber. Okay, just got this. So let's do one thing. Let's quickly crack them open. Or maybe make sure that they don't leave your heart and then as soon as possible you just crack open their shields so that you can deal some hectic amount of damage and then they will be over here you know the rotation oh my oh my oh my god no she might die she might die The reason why I'm using Raiden Shogun is just, you know, you know that. No ways. Don't, don't die. Don't die, no matter what. See, you can actually defeat them, but at the same time you have to. Give up on your healers if you want the DPS characters themselves. The main reason why I'm taking this is to heal everyone because I don't have healer in the second half. The only problem is that. Let's begin. <gasps> okay, I thought I was almost dead. I thought. Do the same rotation. You know the rotation. This is very simple rotation, by the way. Then, then deal the heavy amount of damage. That's it. Do some eye framing stops. I think I forgot the rotation. Yeah. They're not even uh, near. Yeah. This enemy is easy when you get to get the notice of how you can defeat the. Uh, I mean, how to use the uh, rotations. Don't let yourself die. They'll jump. Again they will jump. I knew that. Now use her ultimate. You might die as well. You have to take the risk of you have to actually take the risk if you want the... Oh my god, they are here and I am kind of afraid now. 
I'm actually very much afraid of my own team. Oh. Oh. I think I'm not afraid anymore. I'm kind of not afraid because all of them are all of them were dead already. So, yeah. This was how I did it. Hope you guys have enjoyed this one. I mean, you might have enjoyed it or maybe not. It's up to you to enjoy, but this was how I did my rotations in the second half of the spiral abyss but for the first half i think you also got to know that i used navis burst at the beginning and then nihuang's burst at the second and then penny penny boy's boost i mean ultimate and also shangling's ultimate and then shangling's e is kind of like it will just give you some more pyro applications that's it and then i switched back to ningguang to just deal some extra damage by kind of nuke itself like half semi nuke if we are going to say and then Navias E obviously nuking with some 200-400k as you also saw that my Navia did some 220k or 200k at, at least okay my dear okay so the way I have built my Ningguang is too bad, but still it's quite good because I have this one. I mean, I did not get any other proper weapon for her. So yeah, used this, used this. And she is having 85% of geo damage bonus, so she's C6. I need to actually build some more, but I'm not getting any time to build. So it is taking some time for me. She's not well built, but she's triple crowned. How can't you not triple crown a lady who is beautiful? That's it. If she's a beautiful lady, then yeah, triple crown. And as for the Navia, yeah, you can see her attack is kind of too big as well. Thus, but no geo damage bonus, which is quite fine. And I'm using a free-to-play weapon from the, uh, what was that, from the event. And I'm still using uh, some these artifacts which are quite good in their own ways, C0. And one is only crowned and I need to crown this as well. I'll be crowning both of them. As you saw, I just raised it. And I don't have one more. Anyways, so Benny Boy, you already saw my. Oh, there's something. Ah, oh, okay. I did not see that. Anyways, so for Benny Boy, you have already seen these things. I think you have already seen these. Given a Skyward Blade. Only for an energy recharge and high base attack. And don't say that this is bad for him. I'm giving him. Only because it has energy, recharge and also high base attack. That's it. I mean, this is also good. This is also quite good for a penny boy. Noble supply, you know that. C5. I'm not doing the C6. And it is not even... <sighs> done to the level 12. And she's also not even done. She doesn't even have anything. Okay, she does have some... And catch is the one and emblem of severe fight. You know that. And as for the Raiden Shogun, she's a standard built built DPS bra. She's an absolute DPS engulfing lightning. Emblem of severe fight and also C3. And 10 10 13. Or I might be going for C4 as well if if it actually helps. Hmm. Thirty percent damage bonus. Let's see. So Nahida is yeah, 
built with only the tender damage bonus and also some 748 elementary mastery with sacrificial you know these things you don't have to worry about it she's also triple crowned you also seen you have seen this already I haven't changed anything yep same constellation is zero ten 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 and as for Yoimiya she is not yet built but still she is quite built with pyro damage bonus with rust which is actually good oh wait what uh i'm sorry i thought i had built her okay oh i gave it to navia i did not even know that i gave that to navia Okay, fine. This I could have actually given it to her. Now she's 55. Which is too bad, but still okay, fine. I did not even see that I did not give Navia's her best in slot artifacts. I just gave 18% attack bonus. That's it. What was I even doing then? Oh, I need to. Lock this as well. Okay. So anyways, I hope you have seen all my uh, artifacts and also the tips that I gave in the beginning itself. You have to break the shields of both mit uh, Mitachurls, I guess. And also the Geo Slimes damage. So yeah. You can actually, this is actually an easy uh, abyss if I have to say so myself. So, hope you guys have enjoyed it. See you all in the next video with Navia's artifacts, probably. I mean, I'm hunting you guys with a new video. So, hope you guys have enjoyed it. See you all in the next video, mi amigos. Take care, bye.